Hey, Mo, so the rain is cleared, and there still might be some lightning scattered behind me. And whatever, for whatever electricity there is in the sky, it must have taken up off this crowd tonight. 4,000 plus. There's about 4,300 people in attendance tonight to see their HCFC squad conclude their four-game homestand, their first ever homestand here at Joe Davis Stadium. And they couldn't have gotten a better game. You saw in that highlight reel that first play out of the opening kickoff. It was a set piece that head coach Jack Collison and his assistant coaching staff, they designed and they effectively scored on that opening kickoff. What a way to start the game. The crowd was amped the whole way, and they kept up that pace. Even though St. Louis City SC2 was able to score twice in that first half, I thought, at least in my impression, HCFC was still able to control the ball. A lot of the metrics that these teams look at in terms of ball control and shots on goal and the effectiveness of their shots, less so the goals, but the shots that put them in that place, had them in a really fair position despite being down 2-1 after the break. But how about in the second half, just picking up right where they left off, just like in the first half, it was Adem Sipic, the rookie, 18-year-old rookie, in his sixth ever game as a professional, his first ever career start, getting a goal. I mean, what an awesome moment for him. He was uh, showing up big tonight. And later on in, in postgame, head coach Jack Collison was talking about how Adem, despite him being one of the younger guys in this roster and still participating in his academy-level program with Nashville, SC, that he brings a professionalism and an approach that's really part of the buy-in that this team has tried to exemplify in this early going. So it's really cool to see him get that chance early on. And so just like that Fantastic moment, we Allison, the game and I must credit that what he's got to say after the game following their big win. How we try and move, and it's actually a set move that come off, so you can see the excitement when it comes off. And then disappointing to concede two poor goals again, but part about this group is development. We talk about development a lot and learning from mistakes from last week, not to go behind even further. And we come in at half time and we, we knew we were really in the game. I said to him, do you feel like we can win the game? And they all said yes. By Adam Sipic. And so after this homestand concludes, they're on a quick turnaround to get into their first road game out of the country. They're going to Toronto to face Toronto FC2 on Thursday. And it's a quick turnaround again from that as they're back in town here at the Joe for a game on Sunday against Inter Miami. And with that... Uh, HCFC, they're going to try and climb these standings. These are big games coming up in the Eastern Conference playoff race. At Joe Davis Stadium in Huntsville, Simon Williams, Fox 54 Sports.